Hi, let me introduce you to Fancy Perlin. This is a plugin that generates noise shaders based upon the fractal shader of wire, but adds a lot of options and effects to make it very fancy. It has three modes of operation. Source, this, this is what you see now. Displacement displaces the video that's playing beneath. And Combine, which combines the video using its alpha. So if I move this crop around, you can see how this interacts. This place also takes notice of the alpha. These are the operation modes. And now let's dive into the shader part of this plugin. Let me run through some of the presets for you so you can have an idea of how powerful this plugin is. You can create a lot of uh, noise types, a lot of different vibes and even stars and even some strings. Let's have a look at what is what. So this is more like the typical uh, Perlin noise. There are three main operators um, and you can add the distortion. You can scale it. The gain controls the, the pieces that stay white that don't cycled in the cycle and then we have the cycle impact this you can use to merge the two together so if you have a very uh, jagged cycle you can merge it back with the original gradient so this gives a very nice effect in position we have three options to animate the noise typical is to use speed z this will move the noise through the depth, um, but you can move it up and down, left and right, um, and these will generate infinite amount of noise. It's not infinite because it's a computer, so there will be a point when it needs to reset to zero. There's also the option to move it manually. These also don't loop, but you can use these as uh, like a camera camera options. In uh, levels we can manipulate the gradient. Use your base, the um, midpoint creates a curve. So if you want a concave and nice round bezel, a ratio creates a contrast and also adds a clip. So now you can see the white is uh, clipped. And we can also clip it manually with the clip function here. Cycle combined with the um, cycle impact creates uh, stepped gradients. Um, and if you want more, you can also posterize it. And this gives very, very hard values inside of the gradient, which are nice when you add um, edges on them later. And then there is the option to invert everything, create your colors. Here everything becomes to look very fancy. The edges in the emboss also are active in the displacement. So let me add some edges and some emboss and some colors in the emboss. So this will, the emboss will emulate your lighting and with the angle you can choose the angle you want it. And like I said, this also applies upon the in the displacement mode. So there's a lot of options to fine tune to get the vibe you're looking for. So I hope that you liked what you see. Try it before you buy it and um, have fun.